Hi, my name is Dean Paul Denniston, and today we'll be going over the key features and assembling Razer's new Crazy Cart Shuffle. The Crazy Cart Shuffle is kid-powered, meaning there's no batteries to charge or maintain. That means it's always ready to go whenever you are. Like the rest of the Crazy Cart line, the Crazy Cart Shuffle drifts, spins, and is extremely fun to ride. The Shuffle is designed to grow as you grow. It has five lengths to choose from and is easily adjustable without any tools. With the Crazy Cart Drift Bar technology, the handlebars double as drift bars. Simply lift to drift. Now let's get to the assembly. This is an easy process. It should take you approximately 10 minutes from start to finish. You will need the following tools. Two 5mm Allen wrenches. This process can be completed in four easy steps. Step one, assembling the seats. Step two, attaching the pivoting foot bar and front wheel. Step three, attaching the rear caster wheels. And step four, attaching the flag. Now let's see what's in the box. First thing we have are the caster wheels. Next, we have the flag. Now we have the pivoting foot bar and front wheel. Next, we have the frame with the seat. And finally, we have the instruction manual with the two supplied five millimeter Allen wrenches you need for the assembly. Let's get rid of this pesky box and get started on the assembly. Now let's get started on step one, assembling the seat. Take the back part of the seat and slide the fabric over the frame. and the two back posts slide onto the receiving post of the frame. Once they're in place, press the pins and slide down until it clicks. And that concludes step one, assembling the seat. Now onto step two, attaching the pivoting foot bar and front wheel. Using your two five millimeter Allen wrenches, let's remove the two bolts from the front half of the frame. One Allen wrench on the top of the bolt, one Allen wrench in the bottom of the bolt and loosen. And do the same for the other bolt. Now that we have both bolts out, we can attach the two halves together. Slide them together and line up the holes. Slide the receiving bolt down from the top. And from the bottom, thread in the bolts. With both the bolts in, we can secure them tightly with our 5mm Allen wrenches. One wrench on the top, one wrench on the bottom, and tighten. With the bolts tightened, that concludes step two, attaching the pivoting foot bar and front wheel. Now onto step three, installing the rear caster wheels. First, let's flip the shuffle over. Let's remove the rubber thread protector. Take your 5mm Allen wrench, and place it into the bolt inside of the wheel housing. Now loosen while holding the rubber thread protector to thread it off. And do the same with the other wheel. With the thread protectors off, we can install the caster wheels. Thread them into the frame. Do the same with the other side. Now using your five millimeter Allen wrench, tighten down those casters. With it tight, let's move on to the next one. Once the casters are tight, flip the shuffle back over. And that concludes step three, installing the caster wheels. Now onto step four, attaching the flag. Simply connect the two halves of the flag together and slide the flag into the flag holder. And that concludes step four and the process of assembling our Crazy Cart Shuffle. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it helpful and informative. But if you're still having any other troubles or complications, please feel free to contact customer support at razor.com. Bye-bye.